Hey guys, all right. Um, I'm up just popping these videos out right now, but I wanted to show you this hair that I got from ZaraWigs.com. This was a custom wig. The, the lace is still on. My net is off. Light, and you know I got a little work to do. You know I just wanted to slap it on to show you, but I'm gonna do updates later in the week so you guys can see what it looks like. Um, but this is a full lace. This is Malaysian hair too. And um, there's no name for this on the website because I ordered it. So um, it came to like 620. I forget, like 620 something. But it's customized for me. It's um, it's really really nice. And I have to like let it flow a little bit because it's been in the lock. And plus my hair under is a big mess, so I just it's not even braided down or anything. So please ignore that, but I just guys want, want you guys to see the texture of this hair, which is absolutely amazing. And here's a part from parting space. Um, and it took them about... Um, Two weeks to do my order. Like I said, I order from Zara with. Um, so, anyway. Here's some more. Okay. Um, this one was, uh, shit, 22 inches. And I think they count from here to back because it's gonna be looking like twenty. Like when I order from websites like with full lace wigs, and every time you know they do it for me, it never looks as long. Like for example, I have that long curly one, and that one looks like twenty two, but these gonna be looking. So I think they count from here to like this, and then that would probably be twenty two. But anyway, whatever, I'm happy and very, very happy with this hair. Um, let's see. It's so pretty, like, I cannot wait to get it tamed and combed and, you know, done, curly, maybe. And do different stuff, but I'm just not ready to cut the lace off of these yet, just because I'm not going. I always do that, like, I just I feel like it's fresher or something. <laughs> I look at the hairline on this one, it's really realistic looking. Damn cat. So, see. And, you know, um, just, I want you to just see that texture, like how gorgeous. Some people are into yaki. I've tried those things before, but they look so, I don't like it. I don't like the way it feels either. It feels like horse hair. So this is like silky. I feel like it goes good with me though. I think some people, like it's not believable, but I think it looks believable on me. When it's, you know, styles up and everything. So, if you guys have any questions, I'm not going to keep rambling. But if you have any questions about this website, and they're not paying me for this. I wish they were giving me a free wig to do a review on, but not that fortunate yet. So, anyway, um, if you guys have any questions, go ahead and hit me up. Um, oh, I didn't show the back, I'm sorry. Let me show you the back. So, and again, if it looks puffy or bunchy or something up there. I'll fix all that, um, you know, just, I gotta get it, you know, 
So anyway, like I said, if you have any questions, this is from ZaraWigs.com. This hair is so freaking pretty. Like I'm looking at it. And again, like if you haven't seen the last video, these websites are not like um late or um, misswigs.com they're not like fast and secret these are the real like you know that I'm gonna cut off some hair off this bitch and then I'm putting it on a wig like that's the kind of companies I like to mess with that's why I don't mess with those little I mean I I, I you know of course the, lat, the long curly one I have is it's nice but I feel the texture just gets so weird. And if I haven't said it already, I ordered from Zara wigs uh, a year ago, about a year ago. And I ended up selling that wig just because it was um, a little bit too light for me. I tried to wear it, you know, for a little while, but it just didn't fit. So I'm trying to get more into the light wigs to be versatile. But um, I don't know. So um, if you have. Any questions, anything you want to know about this hair, any, uh, um, and, and, and if you guys feel like it's a little too expensive to get a custom wig, go look at their stock wigs. They're pretty cute. And, um, you know, they're stock, so they'll fit. I just wanted a custom just because, you know, I felt like if I was going to pay that much money, why not get it to fit exactly for me? So, um, I'm happy with my purchase. I probably won't be making no wig purchases for a long time because it was expensive to buy these. Total, I paid over $1,000 for both wigs, but I'm happy. Very, very happy. So, if you guys have any questions, let me know. I'll put the link down below to show you, um, to show you the website. And, um... Also, I have a giveaway going on. Go ahead and check that out. And I also have my 22-inch um, curly lace wig on sale. And it hasn't been sold yet. So if you guys want to check that out, then um, go ahead and do that. And um, that's that. So I guess I will talk to you guys later. Bye.